Hey what is up guys and welcome back to another Xbox 360 tutorial. Today I will be showing you how you can download Xbox 360 neighborhood so you can transfer over your files from your PC to your Xbox via FTP. But before we start this video you are going to need Aurora File Manager, Dash Launch, XCX Menu an Xbox 360 that has been modified and also it can connect to Wi-Fi a USB drive and a PC so let's get started so first of all we need to go to our PC you're going to need these two files which I will put in a media file link that I'll be hosting in the link in the description now you need to stick your USB drive in your computer, go open file manager, scroll down, right click on your USB drive and press format. It needs to be FAT32 and it also doesn't matter what the name is so name it's everything you want. So it's formatting. Now we just need to open the file manager, find the formatted USB drive. You don't need formatted, but it is recommended. And we just drag in the plugin over to the USB drive. And that's everything for the USB drive, we just eject it. We're gonna be installing the Xbox 360 SDK, which is Xbox 360 neighborhood itself. We just press yes, press next. You can read this if you want, but there's no point in reading it you just press next we're going to run the minimum installation for this and now we just need to wait so now we've successfully downloaded the SDK, we'll just press on finish it's gonna bring a page on your browser, you just click on close and I'm gonna see you at the Xbox for the next step so now that we're back at the Xbox we're gonna go into my games and to XCX main so when we are at XCX menu, the first thing that we want to do is press RB or LB a few times until we see this menu. And over here on the bottom line, we can see our IP address. We need to remember this address for later when we actually sign up our Xbox in the SDK. But for now, we go into apps and launch a wall and this is the point where you want to remove your USB drive from your computer and plug it in in your Xbox now you just need to press the back button file manager here we choose HDD1 here USB 0 and here is our plugin. We just press X and we scroll down here, press copy. It's copied and now paste. And we just paste. So the file is successfully transferred to our hard drive. Now we need to go into dash launch. going into dash launch install default.xcx so now we are at dash launch 
we are going to want to build plugins. Here is our proto plugin. And also this XBDM plugin needs to be first. And then second your other plugins, which is in my case the proto plugin. Now we just press RB, scroll down to HDD and press X to save. And now you just need to reboot your console. And I'll meet you at the PC one last time. So now that we have successfully installed the plugin and the SDK, you're going to want to click on Xbox 360 Neighborhood. Add Xbox 360. Click Next and type in your console's IP. And click on next. I'm not gonna set it as default. Click finish. And it's added. Now we double click. And we wait for it to load in. As you can see, it successfully loaded in into the hard drive, the game that I have inside, all that stuff. And that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope this guide was useful. If you have some issues, don't be afraid to ask in the comments. And I'll see you in the next video.